Let's go with the Owen Stalker. I'm in a good mood today. I don't want to. Tom McDonald's going to put me in a sour mood. All right. Okay, check this out. So she's like still I just there. Travel back into the oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, she's still in Idaho. She doesn't love See, That's a just standpoint Idaho. She lives here now. now. Past. Like back to my hometown. Pretty town. In New York. I, I, I give them that agree, money. of course. It's a pretty town. I, I like old towns like that. Yeah. Where Owen came from. And then we both end up in <clears throat> California. Southern California. And then. Oh, man. You, you know what's sad? The industry's gone there. You saw the, like, for sale signs. And we both end up in Washington really close. Like. No, 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 no. You both didn't end up in those places. You're following, following him like he's the Grateful Dead. It's, you really do sound like an ex that's stalking. Yeah. Oh, wow. You shop here, too? And it's like, you live in Lakeland. What are you doing here? <clears throat> are you really driving to Fort Myers to go to the Publix? Like, oh, you shop here? <laughs> like only a couple hours away from each other. And then we end up in Soyan Point. Even closer together. But because... <laughs> You followed him. The fact that she keeps it ended up, we just ended up at. We always end up here at the same place at the same time. What are the odds? Very high if you're following him. Yeah, very high when he puts his PO box in his video description and you drive to that post office. Come on, guys! What? She's covering the mic, of and course. The signature move. Go to the I post office and go. Is there? Have you seen a really tall guy here ranting about? in the moon and they're like yeah he comes in every other day oh, yeah he'll yeah, be here probably like three o'clock i'm here to collect this mail can i have it and then she finds his house and if i mostly is czech you know slovakian <clears throat> isn't that true is that her car oh this is her car that she's living in no i don't are you sure yeah doors open look oh, okay <clears throat> But I saw the Look old... at the blanket and stuff in there. Okay, yeah, because I saw that the old man was also walking, so I didn't know if that was his car. Yeah, look at all that crap. In yeah, there. yeah, that's 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 her. That's her wow, house. is there just a bucket of chestnuts in the back seat? I think so. <laughs> Isn't that trippy? Oh, what the hell? An old caddy. I'm pretty people. sure the maniac is living in his car. Yes. <laughs> you know the voices in the maniac's head. <laughs> the best line in that episode was. You know, you guys are good guys. You remind me of my sons. Oh, it's you have like, kids? Not anymore. <laughs> it's like the best. He was ever. so great in he that. He was so away, good. And they're like, I'm starting to think this guy's a legitimate maniac. <laughs> <laughs> so look at this. They got old. Cover the mic. Theaters. This is Ritzville, Washington. I just went in that little Ritzville, thing. Washington. And... What? Cut some glasses so I could do my Billy Goats impersonation when I get my lavender sweater so I can come hypnotize y'all. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm going to go no, to Oh, yeah, she little... is in Ritzville. I'm, I, if you type in Ritzville, Washington, if you go back, you see that big, yeah. the building with the big spire. Is she it's, back in Washington? I guess so. Thrift store down here and check it out. There's a deli in the thrift store. Yeah, that, that building my... with the spire is yeah. literally, if you go to the Wikipedia page, it's called the I'm Gritman bad. Building in downtown Ritzville. With me. Anything. I don't think there's any bikes or anything to be stolen by the bike thieves. Still doing that Owen bit, you know, stole my bike. We should, yo, we should go move and take over Ritzville, Washington, because weed's legal there. And there's all these old buildings, and we could probably buy the whole city. Owen's talking about thieves, gays, dicks, penis, anus, anuses, and stuff. Shut Hidden in plain sight, guys. Look, to be fair, I mean, Owen is a shitty comic, but he is still a comedian. So, mm -hmm. generally, comedians are going to have a hard time getting through an entire show without making a dick or a butt reference. Of or, course. I mean, come on, lady. Let's let's start. Look, we've all made our jokes about Owen, and trust me, we've we've shredded Owen on this show. Um, the gay thing is always something these like ex bears always try to like, and I'm like, Owen's a lot of things. I don't think he's. I think Crowder's gay. I don't think Owen's gay. I think Owen's a fucking lunatic. Huge penis means a big dick. Closed. 
Oh, and then the, uh, oh, they're only open on, on the weekend. Oh, 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 are we going to get, we have, a fa we have a face reveal? That's about what I expected her to look like. Yeah, it's not, uh, it kind of looks like Harvey Dent. <laughs> Can he be trusted? Looks like what Aaron Eckert will look like in 25 years. The weekend, and the dogs came out cute in the store. I wish I could have videotaped them. Dogs love me. All animals love me. Well, because they don't have oh, any well, real sense so. of, you know, what your babbling is. And then uh, this is the newest one. This one is from today. People all around the world. How are you today? Well, here is my morning drink. Still doing it. Even though I'm living in my car on the road again, um, I bought a big bag of lemons at Costco yesterday. Do you have scurvy? Yeah, you gotta make sure you don't catch scurvy if you're living in your car. That's how I heard you get it, right? It's a what, pirate disease. Well, yeah, but they were living in the the old equivalent of your car. Oh, fair enough. A, it's just a car on water. It's okay. okay. Got a few things, even though they didn't want me to come in without my mask. I was even escorted by a young man, a very tall young man. I said, is this, is this a date? He goes, yep, just me and you. He took me all the way to the back where it was closed and got uh -oh. special permission to go in. This is all accommodating me because I won't wear a mask. So what me you're saying the... is you're, you're admitting gleefully that you're a massive pain in the ass and that... By by having to be a pain in the ass, you're now making a guy who probably doesn't make a lot of money. No, probably of makes not. ten, eleven dollars an hour. Now you're making him work harder. You're making the entire store change its shit around just for you. <clears throat> but keep telling me about how your refusal to wear a mask is heroic work. How you such a I'm tired of people doing that. Like I'm such a good person, I won't wear a mask. And it's like you're just making some shitty workers' day shittier. Like, just, just do it, man. I had to buy a mask. I went out to Ebor Friday night because I was helping my buddy move, and then it was like his last night in town. So I was, we went out, and um, I forgot my mask. And I had to pay like five bucks for a mask at the bodega because it's, it was either that or be a pain in the ass. And it was like, uh, I, it's on me. I'm out five bucks because I know the rules. And I, but I did get a nice, uh, they got the ones that they print on, so I got a little, uh, they had the, the Versace ones, and they had like the Burberry ones. <laughs> Which one did you get? I had a Burberry one, because it matched what I was wearing better. I don't even look at you. <laughs> they didn't have plain white ones. They, yeah. It's the only ones they had. Mm -hmm. U.S. Canadian border. <clears throat> so there's my lemonade drink. I squeezed the lemons into a jar, put some maple syrup in, then I went into a that shell station. Terrible. That sounds awful. I, I, all of this is terrible. Where they always have hot water for coffee. And they let me take hot water for free, even though I offered to pay for it. And uh, there's my drink, nice and hot. Nice and hot and ready to go. That's my break fast. I break my fast. Yes, is that know, what that means? We know the origin of the word, lady. Is that what that means? Uh, Each morning. There's nothing worse than the people that share factoids everyone knows. But they'll be like, did you know? Yes, I knew that. <clears throat> well, here's a nice, quiet, serene sight. That is pretty. This Wherever is she's at, I, look at that. That is, that is very pretty. Wherever she's at. Oh, That's it's amazing. really nice. Called Levensworth. It has some close high mountains. It's oh, so the Alps. The Alps. It's a fudge shop. Yeah, it's also Washington. It's a little German town, like a little Bavaria. And look at all that beauty. You see, I took the scenic route. Fuck a bunch of. Look, man, I love Florida, and Florida has a lot of things that are very pretty and beautiful. But this stuff, this I will, I will admit that I am. Pacific Northwest, I am jealous of this kind of stuff. Like, this stuff's awesome. Like, the, the how pretty it is there is, is really nice. Oh, it's amazing. The politics suck, but...